everyone, April here from Finding My Inner Girl. I just wanted to stop in for Tip Tuesday. Um, it's something that I am intending to try to do on a regular basis. Um, there's a few things just as I get more and more customers and I work with more and more people. Um, I start to notice some of the little um, issues that might come up for some people. Sometimes it's just a matter of um, re-going back over application instructions um, or um, sometimes it's just inherent within the product and it's something I've used for a while so I don't think um, about it until I have a conversation with the customer who's experiencing it for the first time. So I want to kind of start a series documenting some of those tips so that people can turn back to it for references. So a few days back, I posted the tip in regards to when you have really super short nails so that you can't do the application technique of breaking it off underneath very easily. Um, if you haven't seen that one, definitely go back. Um, it's in my videos of my page here. And also I did post that up to um, YouTube as well. So on my YouTube channel, Finding My Inner Girl, um, there are a few videos up there regarding app different application techniques, um, showing how to remove, uh, particularly with glitter. I have a technique that I use um, that helps to get the glitter polish off a little bit more efficiently. Um, and then these tips and tricks are also gonna be up there too. So today I wanted to talk about what do you do when you get wear at the tip of your nails, but the rest of the wrap is, or excuse me, the strip is in still in great condition and there isn't very much grow out. Um, sometimes it can happen. It tends to be most noticeable with uh, the darker colors or uh, the solid colors. I did start to notice it on this set that I'm wearing right now. I'm not sure if the camera is going to quite pick it up, but yeah, you can see on this tip here, you can see where the, the polish has kind of just worn away a little bit, so my nail's kind of peeking out. Um, this is day seven for this set, and I just started to get this tip wear literally today. So. Um, the other problem that can happen with tips, and again, it is um, a little bit more in regards to uh, the solid colors, have a tendency to either be more noticeable or to have it happen more often. Um, it actually only happened to me one time and it was with a solid base um, that had just a printed design on it, and that's shrinkage. And um, when the polish goes onto your fingers with the strip, it is 95% dry. And there are occasions where sometimes when it dries that final 5% that it shrinks up a little bit. And when it does that, then that's when you get the same, it looks exactly like this, where you just have that little bit of tip at the top that's kind of poking through. Um, but if you're wearing a bright pink or a bright red, you can see it more. Um, the fix is really easy. Um, you just file it. Take a fingernail file and file down the tip until it meets back up with the strip again and you're good to go until the grow out either gets too far up and you don't want that look anymore or you just want to change your nail strips so that you can have something new on. Um, I hope you all found that helpful. If you have any questions or comments or if you have a problem that you've run into and you're not sure how to deal with it, drop a comment down below um, and I'll be sure to get back to you directly and then it'll also give me information that I can use for um, future videos and future tips. I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.